All right, you guys. Let me try this again. I'm sure y'all know the breaking news with Brittany Griner. So, um, you know, this this is in no way, in my opinion, one of those situations. And you know, most of us are harder on us than anybody could ever be. But this right here, uh, Brittany Griner is sentenced to nine years in Russian prison for smuggling cannabis vape pen through airport. Biden says she's been wrongfully detained and demands she is released immediately so she can be with her significant other. She gets nine freaking years for a vape pen. Oh my God, y'all. That. Oh. Well, we knew she was going to court and we knew she would be found guilty. And so in Russian court, it's a little bit different. They do it all at once. Now, if any of y'all think Brittany deserves because she had a vape pen to get nine years in prison, then, um, okay. I just think that if it was happened to one of your kids or if it happened to you, you wouldn't feel that way. And uh, good thing it wasn't an ounce of weed. I mean, because the 0 0.00, the, the, the small amount that's in a vape pen, She's been accused of drug smuggling. Oh, Lord. She pleaded for mercy, asking the judge. It was an honest mistake. I hope your ruling doesn't end my life. Griner 31 added that she did not want to be used as a political pawn in the tension between Russia and U.S. Griner was arrested, y'all, as y'all know, at the Moscow airport in February for bringing cannabis, a vape, a vape pen into the country. She had been facing a maximum of 10 years behind Bob. So they think her ass is lucky because they gave her nine. Prosecutors requested six months under the max. Damn. The White House has been unable to negotiate a prisoner swap for, to bring Griner to MB, WNBA star home. There is ongoing speculation that she will be swapped for um, that arms dealer dude, Victor Bout. President Biden has immediately announced the sentence. You know, has said, you know, Russia is is wrong. You know, of course. Oh, Brittany, man, God. My heart go out to you, and I hope we can get you home. That's all I'm saying. I'm sure you learned your lesson, you know. And then, like I made mention in the earlier video, Midnight Express, dude had to escape. And you can't escape because you won't fit in, you know. And so, damn, my heart go out to you and your family. God, God be with you. And um, oh man, sad. Very, very sad. Insane. That's all I know. Insane. Uh. <coughs> when they do. <clears throat> Stuff like this. Um, can't tell me that she's not a a victim of a she's a political prisoner. This is what Brittany had to say. I think they got a snippet of her. Uh, 
Yeah. Came my second home with my friends, my teammates, and my fans that I was able to interact with. I remember vividly coming out of the gym and all the little girls that were in the stands there waiting on me. And that's what kept making me come back here. They don't care about that. They do not care. That this is the station, my friends. My поклонники, с которыми я могла взаимодействовать, все это заставляло меня возвращаться сюда снова. I want to apologize to my teammates, my club, the Jenka, the fans, and the city of Kinkat. Not a mistake that I made and the embarrassment that I brought. Я хотел бы извиниться перед моими товарищами по команде, перед клубом, перед поклонниками за ту ошибку, которую я допустила, и за ту позор. I want to also apologize to my parents, my siblings, and the Phoenix Mercury organization back at home, the amazing women of the WBA, and my amazing spouse back at home. Я также хочу внести извинения перед своими родителями, своими братьями и сестрами, перед организацией Phoenix Mercury, перед замечательные женщины женской национальной баскетбольной ассоциации да, ДНБА, а также перед моей э, прекрасной супругой. Я ни на секунду никогда не хотела э, никому навредить, никого обидеть, э, навредить населению Российской Федерации или, а, или нарушить какой-то из законов Российской Федерации. Я совершила ошибку. Совершенную ошибку. И я надеюсь, что в своем приговоре вы не закончите Fucking big bit. I know everybody keeps talking about political harm and politics, but I hope that that is far from the courtroom. I know that все постоянно разговаривают о таком понятии как политическая пешка и о политике. Но я честно надеюсь, что это понятие далеко от данного суда. Я хочу повторить еще раз, что не было намерения нарушить какой-либо из законов Российской Федерации. Я не договаривалась и не планировала. И я надеюсь, что вы также учтете все те документы, которые прислали я также еще раз хочу извиниться перед моими товарищами по команде, перед организацией ВМК. Я никогда не хотела победить им. Это стало моим вторым домом, для которого я хотела выигрывать новый наград. Thank you, 
Oh my goodness. Oh God. Well, it's done. So now the focus has to be on war. What they gonna do? They gonna make a trade for can Good afternoon. Can I'm here to bring the results happen? of the investigation I directed. Uh, following the report of civilian casualties on that strike in Kabul on 29 August. Excuse me, let me get this up. Having thoroughly um, reviewed the findings of the investigation. Uh, man. Okay, you guys. What y'all think about Britney getting 10 years? It's over now. Well, I'm sorry. Nine years. What y'all think? 